Dispersal of seeds. What will happen if the seeds fall and start growing beneath the parent plant? If all the seeds fall and start growing beneath the parent plant, they will be overcrowded and will not be able to get proper sunlight, water and other nutrients. Therefore, seeds must be scattered over a wide area to grow properly. The process of scattering of seeds from the parent plant is called seed dispersal. Some plants expel seeds explosively. Wind or air Seeds that are small and light are generally dispersed by the wind. Seeds of cotton and dandelion have hair around them. These hair help in carrying the seeds by the wind. Seeds of some plants such as drumsticks and maple have wing-like structures that help in their dispersal by wind. Water Seeds of plants that grow near water are generally dispersed by water. Seeds of coconut and lotus plants are dispersed through water. Spongy light fruits of lotus help it to flow away by water. Fibrous coat of coconut helps it to be carried by water. Animals Fruits of some plants such as tiger's claw and xanthium have hook-like structures. These hooks stick to the fur of animals or clothes of human beings and carry seeds with them. Some plants have juicy fruits that animals and birds eat. The seeds of these fruits pass through the gut of animals and are released at different places because these seeds cannot be digested. Guava and tomato have such type of seeds. Explosion The fruits of okra, geranium and poppy burst open when they ripen. The seeds are automatically scattered through explosion. Let's know more. Squirrels bury seeds to eat during winter. Sometimes squirrels forget where they had buried these seeds and the forgotten seeds may sprout during the following spring.